destroyer leader Leningrad was the first ship designed and constructed entirely in the USSR, and Soviet engineers endowed her with huge survivability potential. She fought in the Baltic Sea, starting with the Winter War of 1939 to 1940, and ending with lifting the blockade from the city of Leningrad. She was damaged by enemy artillery and aircraft many times, but always returned to service after repairs. In our game, the newcomer sits at Tier 7, where she'll have to compete for a place in the sun with such popular ships as Kiev and Mahan. To say nothing of the other three destroyers at this tier, will she be able to win the audience's favor? Let's take a look. We'll start with the survivability. She has 15,200 hit points. Only Bliskavica has a negligible 2% more. Other destroyers can only dream of such stats. A low hull is another advantage, as it makes it harder to hit Leningrad. Combine these features with the rudder shift time of 3.7 seconds, and you have a very difficult target. Another important thing is that no ship in the game is able to outrun Leningrad. With a top speed of 43 knots, she's even faster than Kiev by half a knot. It's hard to imagine a Soviet destroyer without their famous 130mm guns. With excellent ballistics and decent firing range, Leningrad has five of them in separate turrets. It's fewer than on Kia, but this way you won't lose a third of your firepower if one turret is knocked out. Unfortunately, their rotation speed isn't so great, which is remedied with the expert marksman skill. What is really uncharacteristic for a Soviet destroyer is Leningrad's concealment. Her detectability range of 7.3 kilometers allows her to fight for control points in the domination mode. Only a Japanese destroyer can beat her in terms of concealment. A short-range engagement with her US or Polish counterparts means trouble. The advantage in survivability won't save you, but Leningrad still has a trick up her sleeve. How many times have the torpedoes from your Kiev sunk just a few meters short of their target, hiding in a smokescreen? Leningrad's torpedoes are a force to be reckoned with. They have a range of 8 kilometers, a speed of 60 knots, and decent damage. It's enough to comb the smoke or sink a battleship. Leningrad is an amazingly versatile ship. She's not perfect, but her advantages outweigh her shortcomings. Leningrad shows flexibility in different circumstances and can use her strong points to prevail in any situation. It all depends on the team composition and your playstyle. We recommend a standard set of upgrades for her. Main Armaments Modification 1, Aiming Systems Modification 1, Damage Control System Modification 1, and Propulsion Modification 2. Any Soviet destroyer captain suits her as long as he has the expert marksman skill. With Leningrad, you have the ability to turn almost every situation to your advantage, while the number of tactical approaches available is limited only by your imagination.